when students are using progress cards, they're practicing many different behaviors to help them achieve their goals. It's important to reward students as they make progress so they continue practicing the behaviors and develop better habits. Unfortunately, it's often difficult to know what rewards are meaningful for children. This is why I've developed different passes for children to cash in when they practice different behaviors five or ten times. First, explain to the child that you want them to sort all the passes into three piles based on how much they like each one. One pile is for rewards that they don't like. The other is for rewards that they sometimes like. And the last pile is for rewards that they love. Younger children may need you to read the passes to them while they are sorting them, and older children can read and sort them by themselves. Once all the sorting is completed, you can put the pile of passes that they don't like to the side. Now you have two stacks of meaningful rewards for this child. You can put the pile of rewards that they sometimes like into a small rewards envelope, and put the pile of rewards that they love into a large rewards envelope. So when they practice a behavior five times, they can cash in for a small reward. Or they can save up with ten behaviors and cash in for a large reward. I hope that you find these rewards to be helpful to use with children when they're making progress towards their goals. When children are rewarded for their extra efforts, they're much more likely to continue practicing the behaviors. Parents, you have 60 different parent passes to use, while teachers, you have 60 different teacher passes. Counselors, you even have 30 counselor passes that you can use with children to reward them for all their extra efforts. For more information about progress cards, be sure to visit www.progresscards.com. Thank you.